Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So, this week's video then we're coming from RSPB Titchwell Marsh. And no real topic of discussion for this week's video, to be honest with you. But more just want to focus around how amazing nature is and how amazing it is just to be out in nature with wildlife. So we are going to be doing some wildlife photography, obviously, if we spot anything. And yeah, I'm just here having a little bimble about around Titchwell Marsh. What a gorgeous place. Let's go see if we can find some birds. So I've just been wandering around Titchwell Marsh for a little while, just around a very small area of it, and uh, what a fantastic tapestry of different habitats it is for, for birds of all different kinds. You've got ponds and reed beds, you've got the marshland, you've got the trees. The place is just fantastic, and this is what I say about how amazing it is just to be out in nature and just be surrounded by this stuff. It really is food for the soul. Yeah. I mean, just listen. So I'm gonna sit here for a bit longer. I've not managed to actually bag any peaches yet. Um, it's very peopley today as well. It is a Saturday lunch time. A lot of birders out today, so. Can't say I'm really surprised, to be honest with you. We've actually got a pleasant weekend, so. Yeah, I think uh, I'll sit here for a bit longer and see if anything comes around, and I'll go for another wander around uh, a different part of Titchwell Marsh. I'm back sat on another bench. Um, <laughs> I'm actually having zero luck today. I say it's very peopley down here. I think there's a lot of people who are A, making the most of the nice warm weather. Um, and they've come obviously come down to try and find marsh harriers and stuff like that. So I've tried to kind of stay focused on the small birds and keep within this wooded area. And I'm having zero luck. I literally had a robin come and land right in front of me. And then for some reason my camera just wouldn't focus. As soon as he flew off, focus not a problem. It wasn't because of the proximity of the bird to me either. It was uh, just <laughs> really random. So it's not just a case of not being able to find the birds. Apparently camera issues are going to play a part as well. So yeah. Anyway, I've still got time down here. I'm in no rush. Again, it's just nice to be out in nature and sit by these ponds and listen to the birds and I mean it'd be nice if I got a picture it'd be really nice but I'm a member of the RSPB anyway so I get free entry into places like this so it's not like I had to pay the entry fee and now I'm starting to really sort of feel a bit aggrieved with not getting any pictures you know anything like that I pay my subscription which is a real real benefit so yeah, plenty of pigeons around today. I think that's a crow as well. Yeah, that's definitely a wood pigeon. So yeah, I'll stick around this bit for a bit, and see if I can actually see any small birds.
Yep, you guessed it, back on a bench. Um, but realistically, for what was turning out to be a relatively unproductive visit down to uh, Titchwell Marsh, has actually turned out to be really productive. I managed to get three decent photos of birds I've never actually been able to photograph before. They're not uncommon birds, but I got a really nice shot. This is all based on the back of the camera. They could have come out horrendously. But um, I got a really nice shot of Eurasian Jay. I got a, a song thrush, I believe it was. It's definitely a thrush, but a song thrush. And it's baby sat together. I've got a couple of the pictures of it feeding from a second visit I made back to the area. And also a blackbird feeding. Weird, because I've never actually managed to grab a photo of a blackbird because they're actually quite skittish. So, yeah, it's actually turned out to be really successful and really productive. Once I kind of steered away from the sort of the seabirds and all that kind of area um, and just spent more time in the woods, it was, yeah, it's turned out to be really productive and I'm still not done yet, but I am going to sign out for, for, for now um, purely because obviously it is difficult to film. There is quite a lot of people about. The, the, the level of people seem to have dropped and for some reason I, can't, I don't know why I'm stuttering my words. Um, the level of people have dropped and yeah it just seems like I, I i can be more productive now the light is very harsh i'm not gonna lie so sticking in the trees is probably a wise idea but yeah oh what a day i just love being out in nature um you never know what you're gonna see and the fact that i don't know how well the f ones of the thrush feeding its youngster have come out but when you're out in nature, that's when you get to see those things. It's an absolute joy and a pleasure to, to be out doing this. So, well, yeah, so I'll sign out now. If, you, uh, if you've liked the video, obviously do give us the old thumbs up. Drop some subscribes from down the bottom as well if you don't already subscribe to the channel. And also press that notification bell. And this is Mike out. Take care, be safe everyone, peace.